guys, I'm Christy Prosperi and I play Imogen on Degrassi. And I'm Annie Clark and I play Fiona. So right now we're hanging in the wardrobe department. Wow, this is so this big. This goes on for days. This is so big, I always forget. <laughs> there are no uniforms this season, so uh, we get to wear crazy things like Like this. dresses and get to express ourselves. It's really cool <laughs> and exciting. This is the belt wall. <laughs> Oh, the uniform. And this is like an inspiration wall for all of our characters. With Imogen, it gets a lot more crazier. She has a lot of cute, like, little maxi dresses, a lot of poof, a lot of, you know, more belts, and I really like it this year. I'm really excited. This is something that Marisol is wearing. She's fun, she's colorful, she's a lot of bangles, a lot of jewelry. This season, Fiona's dressing a lot more edgy. And I think it's because of her relationship with Imogen. I think she's trying to kind of like keep up with her edginess. You may remember this from when she was dating Charlie. So see, like it was kind of, she was into the whole artsy thing. So she dressed a little bit like that. And when she was with Holly J, she dressed like this. And then now, you will see. <laughs> I liked a lot of the kind of like floral 60s type dresses when she was kind of dressing more like Holly J. And you gotta love all her berets. <laughs> I don't, I don't love all her berets. I think this is a beret, actually. So, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I don't think I've worn that one yet. Surprise, this is coming up. I'm here with Sheila, who is our costume designer on Degrassi. You know, it was great to get rid of the uniforms, just because it's so hard to show all the characters, show their personality when they're wearing uniforms. Mm -hmm. You know, we tried to do it with jewelry and accessories and yeah. shoes and boots, but really, when it comes down to it, you know, look how fabulous you look today. This is out this of the is, uniform at last. Bianca's uh, wardrobe. Mm -hmm. So how do you go about creating a character's look? Well, it's um, a collaboration definitely between, um, you know, myself, the director, the producers, the writers. Mm -hmm. We are more character driven when yeah. we look at clothes. So, you know, things that I choose aren't necessarily in fashion, right? Depending on the character, Somebody could be from underprivileged household, they can't afford to shop, so yeah. I would go to Value Village to, to buy their clothes. And that's how we come up with the concept for what they're going to wear. So, hope you guys enjoyed the big wardrobe behind the scenes tour. And get ready for some crazy clothes coming in season 12.